Hey y'all, Rochelle here, your delightful crafter. So again, um, I'm filming this at night, and um, so hopefully you'll either see it tonight or tomorrow morning, um, whenever you get the notification. If you're new to my channel, welcome. I hope you stick around a spell. If you like what you see, please hit the subscribe button. Ding the bell next door if you want to get notifications of future videos. Thumbs up, likes are always appreciated, and any questions or comments, please leave them down below. So, this video is a little combination. This is some... Um, happy mail that I got towards the beginning of December and I'm just now getting around to filming it um Miss Jana who is a subby she's been around uh the channel for a quite a while and she drops in little goodies every now and then hi Miss Jana um thank you thank you and so we're gonna see the goodies she found um, I have looked at everything already, like when she sent it, but at that time, um, we had just lost El Suave, and uh, there was just a lot going on, and so I wrapped everything nicely back up, put it back in the box, and I'm now getting to it, so, so there's that, and then I'm gonna share some Dollar Tree, and some, the items that I ordered from Joann's came in. And yeah, I think that's it for this video. So she did send me an, a wonderful card. Um, very sweet. Um, Miss Jana, thank you so much. I absolutely love it. Not going to read it on um, the video. So, um, but it means a lot, Miss Jana. I really appreciate that. And then this is, this is like, almost a holy grail for me because I have been looking for this for so long and honestly I don't think I still don't think it's shown up in my store but she got me a snow and cocoa 12 by 12 and you know I've seen it in so many hauls and kept waiting for it to come into my store we kept getting the six by six pads so I have quite a few of the six by six and I actually have to send one of those out um, I'm trying to get out in the mail this week, so, uh, yeah, I gotta get that out in the mail this week, so can't forget, but I am so in love with this, um, I'm sure everybody's seen it already, we're just gonna do a quick flip, it's single-sided, um, not my usual colors for Christmas, um, I do prefer traditional, but this is, it's just fun and I think it's stuff I'm going to do for the kids my kids get more into like this kind of color palette so and my oldest oh my gosh he's he goes crazy over snowmen it's it's hilarious so uh yeah so so excited to get that thank you Miss Jana then um we got some other goodies here this here is a miniature. I got a great big old one of these vinyl uh, pumpkin, or not pumpkins, not, um, pineapples, and they light up. And I don't know if you can see it because I've got, let me see if I can cut a light for a second. You see it, it's changing colors. It was just, now we're going to purple. But I have a great big one that sits up on my Alex wall. So, look at that pretty yellow. All right, well, I'm going to turn it back on now. So, very excited about this. Absolutely adore. Too cute. Thank you, thank you. And then, the, she hooked me up in the light department, guys. And she hit the flamingo. She hit the pineapple and the flamingo. Be a flamingo in a flock of pigeons. And this is one of those little um, battery-operated candles, too. And this doesn't have um, batteries in it yet, but I can't wait to play with this one. Super adorable. It's got a glare because there's a plastic uh, protector on there. Love this, Miss Jana. Thank you. And then, look at that one cool cat you can never have enough sticky notes 
I was trying to straighten up my desk yesterday and I found cat kitty cat sticky notes. I found my Pusheen sticky notes. I found two other pads of sticky notes. Yeah, it's it, it it was a really crazy day yesterday. I got some stuff done in here, but not not as much as I should have, but can never have enough of those guys. Let's see. Now, my husband and my son will appreciate these. this. I adore it. Now, I'll probably never use it for its intended use. It'll probably just sit around looking adorable. But I love this bottle opener. That is too cute. Um, I'm not going to give it to my husband because I'll never see it again. Uh, but he, he would use it out in the garage. He has his sodas and stuff out there and... He's got his own bottle opener. This one's mine. Thank you. And these guys, uh, apparently they didn't want to stay in place and they're not behaving, but they're super cute little kitty cat uh, jumbo paper clips. And it's a set of nine. And um, I have a set of these and... So, and every time I see them, I try to grab them. So, I can't have enough of these guys. They're too adorable. Thank you, thank you. And now... Oh! You know what? I have one of these. And um, I was actually thinking yesterday, because it's actually sitting right up there, that I needed to get another one. And I, f I forgot that this came in the box. So, now I have two and I can kind of do like a symmetrical kind of decoration or something so love it thank you thank you thank you and this lights up too it's like a marquee no batteries in it yet yet but um they will be okay and this i don't have the pineapple in fact i've never seen the pineapple so love all these treasures Miss Jana they are absolutely wonderful um, they will all get put to use in here um, loving the 12 by 12 of the snow and cocoa thank you thank you so much so we're gonna stick Miss Jana's goodies right over here oh. come on guys Okay, next, I'm going to show the items I got from Joann's. I think it ended yesterday, but, um, sorry. I'm playing Craft Room Purges and, um, Renos, trying to get the energy back to attack mine, um, because I am behind in updates. And right now, if I gave you an update, it would look like nothing ever happened. So, anyway, uh, Joann's was having the, the week before last, they were running a either a 50 or 60% off everything in the foil quill line. And then last week, up until I think yesterday, it was 40%. I ordered all this when it was the, the higher discount, but I got some more foil. I got the spearmint in the mat, and I wasn't paying attention. Um, there are two sizes. They come in the 12 by 96 or the 12 by 92 inch rolls. Fortunately, I got the 96 inch, but I'm still trying to get other colors, and... Uh, I think I might try ordering some more this week. We'll see. Because I still don't have a silver or the gold. There's a champagne that's stunning. There's like a pearlescent that is absolutely gorgeous. But got the spearmint. I got... Oh, I did get the gold. I got the gold. And I picked up this rose gold, which is absolutely stunning. And these are all the 12 inch by 96 inch rolls. And... um I think I paid 
four something or five something a piece for these. So either the same as or just a little more than what was uh, showing up on Tuesday morning. So there's that. And then, hold on, the USBs. I had no idea that there were so many USBs. Um, so this one is the celebration. So anything anniversary, congratulations, celebration, birthday, anniversary, thank you, another year older, Mother's Day, Father's Day, any basically any kind of celebration is in here. And here's a little snippet at what is on this one. And if you go to the, and, and that, what I'm going to do is, if you go to the We Are Memory Keepers website, if you click on the USBs, you can save uh, an image to your computer that shows everything on the cartridge. And so I'm going to print them out and stick them in a binder so that I can, you know, actually in, in a bigger print, <laughs> see everything that's on here. And so make it easier to choose which USB I want to pull from. So that's Celebration. This one is called Floral. And I think I paid $4.99, I think, a piece for these. Yeah, $4.99 a piece for these. This one's called Floral. So here's a little close-up of what is included on this one. And um, I didn't write the name down. Um, somebody was asking in the comments on my other video when I was showing the foil quilt items what is necessary. So you need the USBs, you need uh, a die cutting machine, so like a Cricut, a Cameo, a Silhouette Cameo, a Brother Scan and Cut, um, can't remember the other units that are out there. You need one of those and you need the foil quill pens and um, these USBs will upload and then your machine will draw these for you because these are SVG files and they're also uh, a PNG format depending on the, the software you're using. So there's that one. And then you need a, a heat activated foil. So you have to pay attention because not all the foils out there, some of them are heat activated, some of them are um, used with transfers. So like with um, this Reactive Mist by Mink, the Deco Foil, or toner images, and then you run that kind of stuff through either a laminator or a Mink, something like that, um, depending on the foil. So, and um, I'll, I'll include this, I'll answer that comment in the other video, but just in case she's watching, I just wanted to put that out there. The next one is Paige Evans, and I think this is showing up in some of the Tuesday mornings, but only two showed up, two of the USBs showed up in the Tuesday mornings near me that I saw. Uh, one of them I didn't have, the other one I did, and then I picked an extra up and one I sent out as a gift. But, um, so these are the images for Paige Evans. And so a lot of this has to do with collections, you know, some of her um, collections that are out there. Love the cat, love the fox, adore the acorn, love the house, just love it all. Oh, look, there's even a paint palette there. Scissors, sailboat. This is going to be a fun one. Um, wander, best ever dream, artistic, whimsy, you and me, keep it real or keeping it real. So happy, dream, here and now, my favorite, cherish, play, and then just so much more. So there's that. Then this one is called Alphabet, and all it is is I believe it's just two fonts. It looks like it's just two fonts. Um, so two alphabet fonts on here, um, or three, there's three alphabet fonts on here. One, two, yeah, three. So 
and it says 200 designs so maybe there's more but this is all that's showing up on here so there's that one excited about this this one is the vacation and here's what is included on this one time to relax route 66 let the good times roll look at that summer cruise we have a cruise ship y'all um airplane skyscrapers stonehenge got a, a little speedboat a uh, flamingo hello so this is going to be a fun one i am looking forward to this one so yeah so there's that then we have the heidi swap here are the peek at the images on this one. And this is so you guys can have an idea of what's out there. Because um, I think only two or maybe three of the cartridges are rolling through Tuesday morning right now. That doesn't mean they won't, the rest of them won't come through. Uh, the, is it Creativation or whatever the, the yearly annual, I can't think what it's called. Where's a cherry on top? They're showing sneak peeks on there. Hold on. Cherry on. Here we go. Sorry. I'm gonna let you know what it's called. Do, 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 do. Yeah, Creativation 2020 is getting ready to happen. So I'm really hoping that they're going to roll out with some more uh, USBs for the foil quill. Um, I have done some research and there's also the foil, the quill etch, the quill emboss, the quill... Uh, there's a... There's more than just a foil quill in the quill line, I guess is what I'm trying to say. Um, so you should go check that out. It looks like some neat stuff. I'm going to be um, researching it a little more and checking to see what I might be interested in picking up. So, but this is the, again, the Heidi Swap. So anything related to the Heidi Swap collections is what you'll find on this USB. And then the Kelly Creates. And I'm pretty certain this one is rolling around through Tuesday morning so and so this one is just a lot of stuff you know create your own sunshine thank you love you mr. And mrs. treat yourself just a lot of like nice sentiments beautiful script fonts um, some images so yeah so there's that um, I showed featured this already in a video this one is the icons and words and so I'm not quite, I think this is like a collection of like images from, from different artists and collections. I'm not quite sure if so there's this one. And then the holiday one, which I have already put away, of course, features holiday images. Um, so, so yeah. So there is that. That is what I got from Joanne's. Now, uh, let's see, let's move this over here. Move that up there. Now, this next stuff, this is from Dollar Tree. I got it last week. Um, Valentine stuff is rolling out. I'm sure a lot of you guys have already seen it in um, other haul videos. Um, like Lisa's hauls. She does lots of really great Dollar Tree hauls. Super cute stuff. K is for Karen. Um, yeah. So, Valentine's is not one of my favorite holidays. I, I don't know why. It's just not. But, I do like the items that I did find. Especially these guys. I picked up four. But, they're glitter vase filler. But, I thought these could be used throughout the year. You could use them in Christmas time, but uh, just I thought it would be fun to include in um, Happy Mail boxes. So I picked up four of those, 
And as you can see, it's different size balls. There's one, two, looks like there's three different size balls in there. So there's that. I uh, picked up just two of these, but I think I'm going to get some more. The LED um, little ropes. There's ten lights. Like I said, I only picked up two. They also had, like, the heart ones, you know. Uh, but I, I, I'm not going to mess with those. These, yeah, I think I'm going to pick up uh, quite a bit more because I could use these at Christmas time as well. So there's that. These guys, I can't remember whose video I saw it in. One, I'm going to dump out all the bubble, the bubbles and put, the, put them in a great big bottle. The kids on the end of our cul-de-sac, the little ones will have fun playing with the bubbles. So I'll just give them to that, to them. But in some Happy Mail hauls that I saw, someone had taken these guys here, nipped off the little wand there you go. Nipped this part off up to the bottom of the stopper. Cleaned them out really well. You know, let them dry for quite some time. And then she used them to put, to gift confetti and sequin mixes in. I thought that was the smartest thing. And so that is why I picked these up. And I think I'm going to go pick up some more. Um, I was hoping I could find some in a white. But, you know, I'm not going to complain. I think I'm going to go pick up two more of each in the pink and the red. So, um, so that's what's going to happen with those guys. And that is it for that bag. Picked up some cheap old Q-tips to use in the craft room. You know, cleaning up little images or round stuff. So there's that. Um... You know the hair product line, Scunchy, um, SCU, Umlaut, NCI? Well, they used to have some really amazing hair clips. Um, I have a lot of hair. I have thick hair. And I like my hair long, but I don't. I can't stand it down because I don't like anything in my face. I know kind of a little contradiction going on there. So my hair is always either clipped up or I use the hair sticks to twist it up and use the stick to hold it or ponytails or whatever well i can't find those scrunchy scrunchy whatever the heck they are hair clips that i loved and the last ones and i bought them like 10 years ago so that's telling you that i have babied them and babied them until you couldn't anymore well thanks to lisa on lisa's hauls she recommended these and I have got to tell you, these are some strong little suckers, and um, they hold up my hair. My hair doesn't slouch. I love it. They're not huge, but they're just big enough, and the way my hair falls in the back, you, you don't even see them, um, and so I buy, I buy lots of these, and I really don't need to, but I think now it's because of what happened to me last time out of, you know, out of fear. I found something I love and they quit making it. <laughs> so I grab these all the time. And I mean, they're a dollar. Um, you know, normally what in Walmart, these are what, four, three to five dollars for a pack of these. So, so yeah. And if they get lost or broken, I'm not heartbroken and I know I've got more. So love those. Oh, did it come off? Oh, no, it didn't. It just didn't have one. I picked up one of the Valentine boxes so I can um, send uh, some happy mail out to somebody. Um, I think I'm going to go pick up some more. So I thought this one was really adorable. I don't go for the super cutesy stuff, and I just thought that was adorable and fun. And I wasn't sure what I was going to use these for, but I liked uh, these carrots. So I only picked up the two. If I find them again, I'll probably pick up two more for some project. I wish they had a little more green up on top, but maybe that's something that I can address. But 
found those guys. Uh, a little thing of secret. I keep this as a backup. Um, we have co we get company a lot, so like I'll buy stuff like this and stick it under the cabinet because you know when you travel, everybody always forgets something. So, you know, it's secret. It's a not it's a decent brand. Granted, you know they're not their top of the line deodorant, but you know, um, it's there just in case somebody needs it if they're visiting. And I, I have the same thing. I have a whole full, I have a drawer full of toothpaste and uh, razors and toothbrushes. And anytime we travel, like at hotels and stuff, even though I bring my own, I always take the little, the little trial size uh, body washes and shampoos and stuff. I always take them and I have a, a huge mass of apothecary jar because we have really long uh, vanities in our bathroom and in the middle, um, when we have company, I'll pull the apothecary jar, stick it in the middle of the vanity, and they, if they need something, they can pull something out of the jar. So, anywho, and then, um, comfy fuzzy socks. These are actually fairly thick. Pretty impressed. Um, this is like super pink for me. Um, even though I do like pink, I'm more like this pink. This is like eye popping pink. But it's for around the house. And I just thought the little the little guys were cute. Little foxes. There's this tail. So there's that one. And then we have the cute little kitty cat. I think I might grab some more if I see him again. Because these, like I said, and these are super, super soft inside and out. So got that. I think. I don't know. Is that a llama? I don't know what this is. It's a unicorn. So got that one. She probably won't wear it, but it's going in some friend mail. And when she sees it, she knows who she is. Ha 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 ha. So that's friend mail. This isn't super soft though. Um, and the glitter is cute. And she doesn't like pink, but uh, <laughs> it's Valentine's. She doesn't have a choice. There's that. And then the last items I picked up and I pick, may pick up some more um, I only got two of these I love that Dollar Tree is bringing these out for all the holidays they're these little metal words so we have spring bunny and welcome and uh, there's just one of each but I mean for a dollar I mean that's pretty good so I'm probably gonna pick up two more of those um, but I like that. And these, ugh. this is actually from Tuesday morning and I wasn't going to sh share it, but I figured, you know, why not? I don't have a lot of color pencils and I've gotten some wonderful coloring books lately. And the coloring pencils I have, they're all watercolor, and so I save them for that purpose. But Tuesday morning, and, and I already took the tags off. I'm sorry. I think this one was like 3 or $4. And so this is just your hard, your soft. This is basically like sketch, sketch work pencils. So, um, and in your gray tones. And then this one, I want to say was... 17 it was kind of pricey but this is a mix this is a uh, hardcore soft core and uh, there's watercolor in here as well um, there's two trays give me a second and I'll show you oh forgive me this one was $19.99 there's that so these are your watercolors that's what you get for watercolor they call these the Color Pro. So these are your regular um, color pencils. And then you have your regular graphites. These are your metallic color pencils here. And 
I'm not quite sure what these are. These are, oh, these are, it says your pastels and then your charcoals over there. So I thought that's a pretty good set for 20. What did it, let me find the tag. Sorry. Um, it says it was normally $26. I would not have paid $26 for this. I would pay the 20, I wouldn't pay the 26. Um, so anyway, and there, so there is that. <sighs> Wonderful Happy Mail, Dollar Tree, Joann's, little bit of Tuesday morning. Yeah. Oh. And I found these at Walmart. I don't want to go buying bulbs for everything. And, and I thought these would be easy to move around. My son says they're really good. These were only $7.88 at Walmart. And it's just a plug. It works with your Google. Does it work with... Oh, and it works with Google and Alexa. And I guess Cortana. So, but you can download an app from your phone... I'm putting one of these on my husband's lamp. Um, now I have the bulb in my lamp that's hooked up to my Google, but quite often he'll turn his lamp on and fall asleep. And then I have to get out of bed and go over and turn the lamp off. And I'm sorry, when I'm in bed, I'm comfortable and I don't want to get back out. So I'm going to pick my phone up and turn his lamp off. <laughs> um, and then he'll be frustrated the next day when he goes to try and turn it on and he can't figure out why. And it's because I turned it off with the app and turn, <laughs> disabled the plug. Uh, we'll see how much he likes that. Anywho, so I actually picked up two of these. And I think I'm going to go on the website and order another three just to put in the extra bedrooms. We don't go in there all the time. But um, yeah, so this is a whole lot of goodness. I am trying to scale back. I didn't go. I wanted to go to Hobby Lobby, but I haven't been into Hobby Lobby. However, I'm thinking if they follow the past two years, the end of this month and what, uh, first part of February, they may be doing their clearance markdowns again. So something for us to be on the lookout for. So... I do think I'll be bad for that. Uh, well, actually, that depends. I I got a lot of what I was looking for the last couple of runs. So they have to be really good dyes that I'm going to want. Or um, something super cute. I, I don't know. Or beads. I'm really trying to build up the bead stash and stuff like that. So... Anywho, ha, that is it. I hope you guys have a wonderful night. Hope you had a great weekend. And hope you have a fabulous week to come. I can't wait for next weekend because it's a three-day weekend. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Um, however, my daughter leaves Friday. She goes back to college. And I probably won't see her for another month or so. Kind of bummed about that because she's not coming home for spring break. She... She um, is picking up extra shifts at the hospital um, now that she can, you know, actually work on, you know, because she has her clinical hours she has to um, do. And then after those, she performs those, then she can pick up additional shifts and actually make money. And so I think she's doing that during spring break. So I may not see her maybe only two more times until May when she graduates. So I'm, I'm, I'm happy about that. So excited for her. She's worked so hard. But anywho, hope you guys have a great night. Hope you have a fabulous week. Love you guys to pieces. Happy crafting. Bye-bye.